So we're out here in the rain field where this 116 day hybrid is in a heavy silk. And you can see we're just starting to shed pollen. And so the last two days, we're off to the races here. And of course, the goal is to put on every possible kernel that we can on this ear. And so as we're out here today looking at this field, we're checking to say, how are we doing on nitrogen? How are we gonna finish the race? Because at the rain unit, I have lots of opportunity to spoon food nutrients whenever we need it. So you can see here on our path set in our 360 rain app, you can see the spots here where there are no white paths. And so on this 120 feet here, we came in of Y drop and we put on up to 220 pounds of nitrogen, including the 80 that the planter had on it. So we come in of another 140 pounds at V9. And you can see that's also not receiving any water. So it's only receiving what the good Lord's given us and we've had a very good season so far. On each side of it, we got 200 to date and we'll probably be putting on an additional 20. Now, as we go to the south, if we go down here to pass 53 and 54, you can see there that we only have on 150 pounds of total nitrogen, 80 with the planter and 70 with the rain unit so that's where we'll see if we needed the additional nitrogen. The way this field looks today, and if the kind of potential that we have with the great weather that we've had, we're in a 260 to 300 bushel capability. And so I like to live in that 0.7 pounds of nitrogen per bushel raised. And so if you think about if this field has potential to hit in that 300 range with the rainwater that we've been able to put on, we would need to have about 220 units of in, and that's what I've got scheduled, is another 20 units to go on here next week. We just took on two and a half inches this week of rain, and it was a real blessing. So as I look at this stage of this corn, I'm in here and we're digging some roots, and we're taking a look and saying, where's the gas tank? And there's several ways we can do that. You and I can split plants and we can look to see where the cotton pithing is and which node, as we get closer and closer to the bottom, it tells us that we're gonna run out in the gas tank and before harvest. Or we can come out like we've done here today and we can pull soil samples at 12 inches deep and I can come in here. And I, what I usually do in that case for rain where we know that we're doing a 15 inch band of water and I've had ammonia sulfate and nitrogen in here, I pull six cores. So I come out here at the seven and a half to eight inches from the corn plant, and I come down in here, and I just go ahead, and I pull six cores per row. And we just put that right here in the bucket itself. And so I pull six holes across, and I go to a different row and do the same thing. So I'm only checking for if our soil scan, our 360 soil scan, which is gonna tell me nitrates available today. What's this plant have capable in the soil profile in its root system to pick up and finish the race? But basically at 200, where we had 200 pounds on with the rain unit, we have let, left to use yet 91 pounds of nitrogen. That's a lot. And a 350 corn market, as much as I'm gonna reach out and change exactly what happens at Chicago Board of Trade, I have no power. But what I can control is how I manage this factory that we see right here that's gonna put on these ears. And so I'm going for yields at this stage. I'm not pulling back and saying, what can we save in a 350 corn market? What can we cut out of this program here this late in the game and hopefully help our financial picture? To me, it's wide open. So if I put on another 20 units of in, and we bought it for 48 cents, so we're looking at $10 or three bushel, I'll take that shot. I wanna make sure this plant has everything in its potential that it can. So what I see right here, I'm excited. We got green leaves all the way here to the very bottom. The two bottom leaves are showing no nitrogen deficiency where rain's been coming through here. I have to decide, I guess, whether I'm gonna put on the 20 extra units. I believe I will but I like what I see. I think we're gonna finish strong. The ears I've been popping open here are 18 around, so I like our chances.